Hi everybody, it's Amy from Bargain Beauty. I woke up this morning early. I'm cozied up in my blanket behind this camera and I'm like, okay, so I'm gonna open up all of these, you know, different sites that I would find um, interesting or wanna purchase from. And I'm gonna do these videos and I'm gonna do a video on each store and I'm gonna bring all my people these awesome deals. Well, I think Cyber Monday is a bust. <laughs> I really do. Because it used to be that you couldn't get the deals online until Monday. But a lot of the stores that I normally shop at have had these deals live, and in some cases better deals than Cyber Monday deals since Friday, some since Thursday. Um, Right now we're looking at Target, so there is an extra 15% off today, and they do have some exclusions, nothing super crazy, you know, like Elf on the Shelf, um, Apple products, dairy, alcohol, um, Xbox One, they're, they're right on that main page when you go, so just make sure to take a peek and make sure that you look at that before you order, but, so you get an extra 15% off. So, 15% is okay. I mean, do I think it should have been 20%? Yes. 15% um, on a day that is specifically designed to lure people to order from your website, I, th I think it's a little weak, I'm going to be honest. Um, so 30% off kids clothes and shoes plus women's and men's sweaters, fleece, and boots, plus an, you'll save an extra 15% off. So 45% off basically, right? That's the way you look at it. Now, I don't know, guys. Like, I think if anything in 2018, what I'd like for a lot of my subscribers to do is start being able to plan ahead. Get things at rock bottom cheapest prices for the next year so that you don't have to buy items at just 30% or 45% off. Like, you could buy your clothing you know how this works, right? So everything goes on clearance now. Back when we grew up, everything was season in season, right? You wanted a winter coat, you paid full price for winter coat because it didn't come out until October and you needed a winter coat. Now they have winter coats on clearance by the end of November, sometimes beginning of December, and you still have a lot of winter left, at least you do here in Connecticut. Um, bikinis start coming out I mean, by the end of December, it's crazy. <laughs> it's absolutely crazy. Okay, maybe it's a little dramatic, but it's it's crazy. You guys can relate. You see stuff in stores so super early. And I know this past year, every time I've done a video and I've been like, okay, the Valentine's Day stuff. And they're like, what do you mean? It just New Year's Eve day was yesterday. Like, um, I have been doing Christmas videos since the beginning, first week of October some of them the last week of September. I mean, stores were putting stuff out very, very early. Halloween stuff was coming out right after 4th of July. Like, it is crazy. So, it works to our favor, though. I know some people don't enjoy that stuff comes out so early. But as a consumer, it works in our favor. Because you can get summer picnic stuff and 4th of July. Like, you can get all that stuff pretty much clearancing out and still use it for quite a while. Same thing happens with clothing for winter or summer. You can still get clothing in season, but at, at huge discounts because they're clearancing stuff out so early now. You don't have to wait till the end of the season and save it for the next year. When I recommend doing that is when you need the next size up for your children. So I say, you know, when they clear and stuff out, if your child's a 5T, make sure you get the 6T for next year. So that way you don't have to go and buy things at an expensive price point because you need them. You will already have them. And the other thing is, is and I wish I would have done this with my daughter growing up. There was like a full year because I had one child and at the time I made a lot of money that she didn't wear the same thing twice for a month so many clothes right now I realized as an adult and as she's become an adult like we wear the same outfits like our favorite things over and over and over again 
So the biggest way, in my opinion, to save money is to not buy so much stuff, number one. Number two, buy stuff for your children the year before for the next year. And that includes Halloween costumes, backpacks, uh, winter coats, just everything. Buy it the year before. I was very lucky. My daughter was always exactly on her age was her size. So she was four, she was a 4T. If she was five, she was a 5T. I was very lucky I could predict ahead. I know not everybody's going to be able to do that. So anyway, buy less. Buy less clothes. You're going to wear the same things over and over again. I have taken down my closet several times. I'm going to do it again. Uh, I wear the same favorite pair of four jeans, um, the same hoodies that I love. I have 10 in my closet, let's say. I used to have probably over 20, at one point over 30. I wear the same ones over and over again. I clean them, I wash them, I wear them again because they're my favorites. They're the softest, they're the warmest. Um, you just wear the same thing. So buy less, buy what you love, then you'll wear it more, right? I know I just got off on a tangent, but like, I just feel like these deals, I guess the bottom line is I feel like these deals are not good enough. Like, they're just not good enough. Cyber Monday is a bust. I think that if you purchase throughout the year, if you're smart about your purchases, if you purchase ahead for the next season, if you've been online since Friday, it's like a whole accumulation of things. If you've been online since Friday, you could already got deals, if not better deals, than I'm seeing for Cyber Monday. Um, online, you wouldn't have never had to even leave your house. So, mm, like... At one point, I had to have every TV in every room, and right now I have a total of four TVs in my house, none of which get used. I had to have, I have a huge TV in my living room. I haven't turned it on in probably a year. No joke. We watch TV on our phones, on our laptops. So we each have TVs in our bedroom. Um, you know, I have one in my bedroom, one in her bedroom, one in the kitchen, one in the living room. I mean, we have TVs everywhere. And then I have an extra TV that I have up in my stockpile closet because it was an amazing deal. So if, God forbid, one of the other TVs went out, I had the TV. We're not TV people. We're more electronic people now at this point. So things we think we have to have, we don't. I'd say buy less. Buy what you love. Be prepared all year online for deals. Like, it's better to spend a little bit of money throughout the year than a whole bunch of money like four times a year. Do you know what I mean? All right, guys, I'm on a tangent. I was going to go through each of the websites, but I got to I gotta tell you, I can't. I mean, if you, if you haven't, sorry about the ice cream in the background. If you haven't got deals yet and you need winter clothes, then I get it. 45% off seems like a good deal. I, I get it. I totally get it. If your children need boots. I got to tell you though, a lot of this clothing is not well made. It's just not. It's like my daughter likes Target clothing as like a second or third option. Her first option is always American Eagle. And even with American Eagle, I find the clothing is just not well made. Like, Target's clothing doesn't last. It just doesn't last. But let's look. Let's, let's, let's look. Let's see what kind of price points we're at. Even their sweaters are really thin. I'm almost, like, feeling like it's better to go to Macy's or Kohl's or somewhere and get a nice warm sweater then get three thin sweaters. Does that make sense? 30% off. Let's see. Let's go to women's. So, women's tech fleece hoodie. C9 Champion, 1959, regularly $27.99. That's your 30% off. 
plus save 15% off online only. Let's. Let's see how much the final price would be. I don't think that's a good deal at all. I'm not trying to be Debbie Downer. But I don't think it's a good price. I think they make this price so high, the original price, that $19.59 is supposed to be a sale price. Mm. Let's put... Sorry, guys, you can't see medium into the cart <laughs> All right, so $2.94 discount. So plus tax because I live in Connecticut, 17.71. I'll pass. Let's go to Walmart. Let's go to Walmart. You see the deals, guys? It's nothing. I don't know if that's a good price on Xbox One or not. We don't use that in my household. Um, the last gaming system we had in this house was Wii. That tells you something. I'm just not. We're technic. We like tech stuff as far as phones and. You know, my daughter always has the latest Apple phone. You know what I mean? And, like, I have to have the latest Samsung phone. But as far as, like, we're not gamers. It's just not our thing. I'd rather be working on my YouTube channel than gaming. You know what I mean? It's not, not for me. I'll play like a game on my phone at night to kind of chill out, relax, and get my mind to rest before I go to sleep, but that's about it. And those apps are free. Keurig Compact Stouts, the Mini, $49.96. The iBot Roomba. See, the Pioneer Woman 30-piece set, that deal's been going on since Friday. Actually, since Thursday. So you could have already gotten this deal. You didn't have to wait till Monday. Cars. I'm not impressed, guys. If you know of something that I'm just not seeing, please let me know in the comment section. Okay, so American Eagle, which is where we shop a lot. Especially my daughter. We They had the flannels on sale for $25. I did a, It was in my video the other day. Now their sweaters are $25. So, and free shipping, I believe. So, if you're an American Eagles fan, American Eagle fan, American Eagle Outfitter fan, um, and you only wear their clothes, then their sweaters for $25 are a good deal because these things are super expensive normally. But, yeah, 40% plus free shipping. Everything on the website is 40% off. That includes jeans, so that's a very good deal. So American Eagle is good, but you could have, my point is you could have gotten this since Friday. Cyber Monday used to be so exciting. It used to be like, you get up, you get your hot chocolate, you get coffee going, you get, you get on that computer. People waited up till 12 o'clock at night. I mean, if you guys are still doing that, let me know, but I don't see anything waiting up to 12 o'clock at night, or waiting up you know what I mean for but American Eagles got 40% off their site but like I said you could have got this since Friday let's see Old Navy you get some free cozy socks with any order you type in cozy at your checkout Cyber Monday 50% off everything if you guys saw my video from last week and this was before Black Friday I had already done this deal and actually my hoodies already came in so, again, not specifically Cyber Monday, but if, I mean, it says Cyber Monday, but I got 50% off not too long ago. Plus, I used Ebates, so I got money back. And make sure if you guys are ordering online today that you're using Ebates. Anyway, um, so 50% off, no exclusions. Uh, you got to be careful with Old Navy. They jack up prices to get that discount in there. Just a heads up. Big Lots, um, new big rewards, $5 welcome coupon for your next purchase. 
earn a $5 reward for every three purchases. You get a birthday surprise. I've never gotten that, and I've always been a um, Big Lots member. VIP shopping, 20% off friends and family. Um, furniture bonus reward. So if you give them your email and your zip code and you sign up, you will get these in your email. All right, 15% off Cyber Monday, the entire site. 15% off Christmas, 15% off mattresses, 15% off everything. Guys, they have reg better deals for their sale deals, like 25% off big lots, 50% off big lots. Like, no, 15% off is not worth it. Don't even bother, in my opinion. 15% off. No. Just say no. Ulta is another one. My daughter really likes to shop at Ulta. A free 22-piece bag set with $75 online purchase. Mm -hmm. 30% off holiday collections. Wasn't this kit just available on Black Friday? Three styles and free luxury robe. Hold up. Where'd that go? Come back here. It'll come by again. I don't know, guys. I don't mean to be Debbie Downer, but there's nothing I'm going to get today. Why did it not go? Well, let's do shop now. Free shipping on any $35 purchase. Ulta Be Charming 42 piece collection set, $17.49. Originally $24.99. Urban Decay Cosmetic. Online only naked on the run. Normally $54. $27. And both those items have special gift with purchase. Pureology $13 to $20.50. Multitask Hair Beautifier. I have a cosmetology license, so I just go to oh, um, not Cosmo Pro, and um, I can get Pureology is an amazing brand. Like it was, I worked in a high end salon at one point, and that's all we would use was Pureology on our clients. Like that is the, and it was so expensive to stock at the back bar to shampoo your hair. Normally, salons like to not use super expensive stuff because they go through so much of it. But that product was amazing, and especially because we were so color-oriented in that salon. Like, color was our thing. That's how we made our money. Everyone had color in their chair all day. Pureology was amazing for color. Lime Crime, $10. So only, online only matte velveteen lipstick, $10. Ulta Online, only most coveted woman's fragrance sampler. Tarte Build Your Beauty Discovery Sets. And these have special gifts with purchase. I mean... Peter Thomas Roth Online Only Mix and Mac Mask Trio. Normally $150. $79. Special gift with purchase. So if there's something you absolutely love, you use all the time... I mean, obviously... It's a good time to get get it at Ulta, but I mean these deals have been going on for a few days. Not these specific ones, but some of them have been. Dose of Colors Online only. Lip It Up Satin Lipstick, ten dollars. I like love the packaging, and that color looks absolutely amazing. I did see that on the main page. It was down a little bit further. nothing I have to have what I have to do is use up the makeup that I have and then start rebuying stuff there's some pretty colors in this line Wow very pretty colors in this line I don't know how it wears I've never tried it but those are nice. Love that packaging, guys. Look at it. 
It's a really nice moth. Very, very pretty. So, yeah, I just thought we'd chit-chat more than, like, go crazy about every single store. I'm not going to do a bunch of videos today. I want to tell you that American Eagle, it's still a good deal. It's been a good deal. Walmart, mm, Target, not, I, Big Lots, definitely not. Um, Ulta, maybe some deals. I don't know what your favorite store is to shop on Cyber Monday. Let me know in the comment section below. But, um, yeah, it's like 7 o'clock in the morning. I just thought I'd pop on here, check it out. I was all excited, going to gear it up for lots of videos. But now I'm going to gear up to clean my house. <laughs> because, well, I might take a little nap. I'm tired. I'm tired today. I've been hanging out with you guys all weekend. Oh, that was so rude to yawn, and so many people will be like, she yawned in her video. My channel's so real, and it's so down to earth. And a lot of you guys know that, and that's why you come back. Because it's not pretend I have money, pretend I have this, martyr you what you have to do or not do. You know, we just hang out, and we're just all doing the best we can with what we have and I think that's why we all bond so much together. So I will talk to you guys soon. Have a great day and happy, happy Cyber Monday. <laughs> Bye guys.